One thing I actually really, really disagree with is people selling these Amazon Fire TV Cody sticks for 60, 70 quid on eBay, when really all you need to do is download Cody yourself on a normal everyday Amazon Fire TV stick, which one of the selling points or main selling points of the Amazon Fire TV stick is it's low price. So I don't understand why you'd give extra money to have that installed. Which has led me to uh, making this tutorial for you guys. So follow along and I'll show you how to put Cody on. And you can save that chunk of change for, I don't know, get some wine or something. Now first thing you want to do is set up your fire stick initially. It's really easy to do. You just go through, um, it'll connect you to your um, Wi-Fi and everything. It's fine. Now from there you want to go to settings and you want to go to system. After system, you want to go down to developer options and turn apps from unknown sources on. Now, apologies, I do have to point my camera at the screen because uh, the stick has HDCP, which means I can't record it directly. But when you've set up your initial uh, Cody, uh, sorry, Fire TV stick, what you need to do is go to apps and it is in the top three. You want to download this app here, ES File Explorer. You can see it right here. Now, when ES File Manager is downloaded and you open it, this is what you'll see. What you want to do is go over to Favorite and then click Add. And it'll tell you to add to Favorite. Now, path, you want to type in the HTML page, HTTP Cody.tv slash download. As you see it here, copy exactly that, including the HTTP colon and the correct dashes, slashes, whatever you want to call them. Now, the name you're going to give it is anything. I'm going to call it NOP. You can see, add. So you can see bookmark NOP is created successfully. It can be anything. So where you want to go down to is NOP. That's going to open up this web page. Now this is the fiddly part. What you want to do is, and it's a pain, I know, Go onto the web page and you can see a little cursor there moving down. Move down the website. It is so fiddly. And you can see that the current release is here. Now what you're aiming to press is Android ARM. So let's attempt to do this. I'll see if I get it. There we go. Click it. And as you'll see, nothing will actually happen. That's fine. That's perfect. That's exactly what we want. So from there, we go to the more option. and select open in new browser open with ES downloader I'm going to put just once, you can put always, it really doesn't matter and it's now downloading the app for Cody. That easy, mate. Cody's only a small file, so don't worry. There, Cody's there. So now if we open the file, you will get an option to install.
brings us onto this screen. Click install. And it'll install. Now as you can see Cordy's installed. Click done. Or click open. Click open if you want to open it right there. And you can see it's preparing for the first time run. This will set up Cordy. And then it will load up. There we go. So now you have Cordy on your Amazon Fire Stick. Now I'm not going to tell you how to um, put add-ons on for the simple reason I don't endorse um, the whole copyright issues. So uh, if you want to watch copyright material online that is illegal and I'm not going to tell you how. But hey I'm sure many other people on the internet would tell you how. So go search that out. But uh, that's how you put Cody on. Thank you.